War always carries a cost, and my war on crime is no different. The truth is, no matter how hard I fight, sometimes I have to lose. In order to save Selena from this fate, I had to give myself up. My life for hers. Now, there's nothing to stop Harley Quinn and her crew from killing everyone at the Sanctus facility and stealing a virus that could wipe out Gotham. Meanwhile, I face the cold embrace Try the auto locks on this chamber. I need to prime it before I can activate it. I'm here. I'm here. Harley had me thrown into one of Frieza's cryo chambers. But I'm okay now. Oh, well, that's a relief. I'm afraid I was starting to panic. I've got it under control, Alfred. Is the pact still in the subway? No. I'm bringing the car around. Call Waller. Tell her the pact means to slaughter their way into Sanctus, and I'm going after him. What? You shot on sight, Bruce. I'm not going as Bruce. It's time to let Batman handle things. Alfred, I'm in. Any sign of Harley or the others? got one of the spa workers. More death and destruction. This blood trail looks like they dragged something. Looking for Project Lotus. Down in the elevator. Do you have access? It's got to scan my eyes. <sighs> Another use for Riddler's eyes. Call it for me. No way. Those freaks are down there. They'll kill me if they see me. If you do it, I can stop the intruders that attacked you. 
I'm not supposed to let anyone in there. But... All right. You gotta stop them. Send paramedics. I've already made the call. I contacted Director Waller. She, um, wants to speak with you. Now. Put her through. Batman, where are you? Give me a status update. I'm at the Sanctus facility. I split with the Pact, and they beat me here. It's a bloodbath. I ordered you not to blow your cover. What the hell were you thinking? You could have been there to prevent this. I had to protect Catwoman. They would have killed her otherwise. So instead, you let others die. We'll be there to back you up soon. We're gonna put an end to this once and for all. Looks like Sanctus security barely slowed them down. That's why you have to keep them there until we arrive. That virus cannot be allowed to leave the facility. Don't mess this up again. This door lock requires a key card. No key card here. Those green lights seem odd. Remind me of Riddler. That's Riddler symbol. Some sort of hacking program. Hopefully it was quick. Keycord here. Someone's trapped under there. His final moments must have been. Just enter yourself more. It's too late for that. Stop them. Here. Take my... anything unless I say so. We don't know what half this stuff does. What are you doing? I don't know if you stole Harley's laptop or not, but I'm glad you kept them from icing me. I'm returning the favor. I'm on guard duty along with three gunmen who are all watching that door up ahead. If I hadn't stopped you, you'd be full of holes right now. We don't always see eye to eye. I appreciate the warning. Just wish I could have done the same for these guys. Harley encouraged Freeze and Bane. They killed anyone they wanted. I should have done something more to stop them. But I didn't. Bane! What did I say about touching the equipment? <laughs> Be quiet, you imbecile! I'm going to make this right. 
I'll help you stop them. Whatever I have to do, they're not getting that virus. Whatever it is, I can do it. Good. We'll fight them together. That's exactly what I wanted to hear. Anything in here could kill ya. So keep your hand to yourself. Let's do this. You know what you're doing. Of course I know what I'm doing. Don't you worry about making a mistake. Do not distract him. He can execute this job perfectly. You should be keeping an eye out. Make sure nothing interrupts us. Big lamb, huh? Seem bigger. Everyone else think. What does it matter? There's only one thing here I want. Shut it, you two! Tick tock, Freezy! Get the virus and let's go! It's an automated extraction process. You can't rush it. Life move faster than this thing. Need. You switching sides on us, kitty? I weighed my options and what can I say? I don't like to lose. You made a big mistake. The virus is almost extracted. All right, Bets. What made you think you'd be able to stop all of us? I wouldn't put money on your chances of walking out of here. Maybe we should try a therapy circle. I know all your tricks, Harley. Please. I know your type. You think you know me. But you're so, so wrong. Unfortunately, we have a tight schedule. But I always have time to kill you. Get him, boys! <laughs> Not today! Bad kitty! about yourself. I practiced! Just like I said I would! <laughs> what are you doing? Ah! 
to save them for you. Please evacuate the lab through the emergency elevator. Batman, we're in the facility now. Harley! Wait up! No! I'm infected! What are you doing? You need me! Not anymore. Harley! Harley's getting away. Come on, we'll find... Get Hands down, get down! down! We didn't stop Harley. You did enough. Now get out of here. See you around sometime. Tiffany and tell her to get to the manor. Harley escaped with a virus. Right away. Get me a proper lockdown crew in here, Stat. I want bio scans on freeze. Do not let him out of that airlock. Move it, people! Good work here, Batman. Good work? Harley escaped with the Lotus virus. Your girlfriend Catwoman is nowhere to be found. Same goes for your boy John. So if good work means half the pact is loose in Gotham, and we've got a megavirus in the hands of a psychopath, then yes, this is picture perfect. Oh, I could think of some more colorful words to describe this situation. Catwoman and John are not a concern. Our focus needs to be on Quinn. As much as I hate to admit it, you have a point. Sanctus, right under our noses all this time. Chemical weapons, human experimentation. Sanctus was, is, the darkest part of the Agency's history. Oh, this place is just... evil. And that's why we're shutting it down once and for all. We can take some of this equipment and put it to good use. It's about time this technology was used for good. I couldn't agree with you more, Batman. I'm gonna need your help tracking down Quinn. She's out there with the virus, and that's a threat to Gotham we simply can't allow. Freeze must have an idea about where she'd go in these circumstances. <laughs> Don't waste your time with that maniac. He'd say anything to throw us off track. But he's our best lead. Well, I disagree. Freeze is nothing more than a science experiment gone awry. You best keep your focus on Harley and the virus before anyone else gets hurt. was strange. She just completely shut me down. She's normally so open to all possible leads. 
It's been a rough night for everyone. I don't know. Something seems off. Listen, Director Waller may think it's a waste of time, but I say leave no stone unturned. I'll see what I can find out. Hey, Will. Give me a hand with this, will you? I think there may be something we can salvage back here. Batman, have you come to gloat? <laughs> to revel in what you've done? Of course not. You don't deserve this. You need help, Freeze. <laughs> you think? I'm here to talk about Harley Quinn. I need your help to find her. If you want me to tell you what I know about Harley, I'm going to need something from you in exchange. The agency intends to keep me prisoner with this virus living inside me. They mean to study me. Given the chance, I could beat this just like Riddler. He became stronger for it. You're saying Riddler became infected with the Lotus Virus when he worked for Sanctus. If he could survive it, I believe I can too. That dial, there. They've keyed it into the temperature regulators in the airlock. All I need from you is to turn that dial. Let my body do the rest. Lower the temperature in the airlock. I know that I can fight this. I will do that for you. But first, tell me what you know. I'm so glad you're agreeable. The truth is, the Lotus virus doesn't have to be this. Riddler's blood can turn the virus into something that can heal. That's why we stole his body. Why your friends in the agency had it on ice. My Nora will perish if I don't use Lotus to save her. Bane merely hoped to cure himself of his addiction. Harley already has the virus. Now... She needs a blood sample from Riddler's body. With it, she will have what she needs to create the serum. She'll go for the body first. That's how you will find her. I already have samples of the blood. Look for a temperature-controlled container. No. You have what you came for. Please, do as you promised. I need to get to the subway right away. If Harley's trying to make this serum, she'll go straight for Riddler's blood. I'm coming with you. The secondary properties of this virus. The serum they want to make from it. I've got a feeling Director Waller didn't want us to hear that. Which would explain why she steered you away from Freeze. 
What is she up to, I wonder? She can't keep secrets from me. I always get to the truth. <laughs> I have no doubt. Don't worry about that now. If we hurry, we can intercept Harley at the lair. We could use Bruce on this one. The less attention we draw to ourselves, the better. What does that mean? If Harley sees Batman coming, she may do something drastic. But if she sees Bruce, she'll think she can take you. You don't know I'm the one that told Waller who you really are. Hmm. Are we... Are we all good? I'd like to clear the air. Sure. We're good. <sighs> all right then. I suppose I should have seen this coming. She's become more and more erratic since she came to Gotham. I hardly know what she's going to do next. Harley? No. Director Waller. You say she can't keep secrets from you. I never thought she'd have reason to keep them from me. Ah! Damn! Ow! Ah, the hell is wrong with this thing? Ah, damn it, sorry. I... I... I've got a passive anti-surveillance system running. It must have triggered What did your... you say, Bruce? Looked like you were speaking, but can't hear so well without these. I was saying the car as a passive security system. It triggered feedback in, in your hearing aids. Crappy agency technology. Not your fault. Look, it's fine. I'd just rather not talk about it. I have to admit, a part of me was sort of hoping we'd be taking the Batmobile. Not that this car isn't great. Oh, we are taking it. I don't follow. I push a button, the armor plates flip, and voila. Batmobile. That's incredible. If you're not just pulling my leg. Yeah. Lucius Fox was a genius. You've put a lot of time and energy into this crusade. I prefer to think of it as a mission. Do you ever question it? Not the mission. I mean, the methods. The clandestine nature of what you do. The fear tactics. The occasional brutality. No judgment. Just curious. No. Never. Damn. I wish I had that kind of confidence. I'm having a bit of an existential crisis. Existential crisis? <sighs> yeah, it's Waller. Why wouldn't she want us to know what Freeze told you? Things have gotten gray recently. Too gray. I don't know if I'm on the right side anymore. Maybe I shouldn't have brought this up. You should trust your instincts. They're what make you good at your job. I'm glad to hear you say that. It bothered me when she allowed the pact to obtain Riddler's body. Wait, that was intentional? I've had deep reservations about Waller. <laughs> Can't believe I just said that out loud. But you told her I was Batman. Bruce. Hey, you sure you're okay to do this? Absolutely. You know, I looked through Gordon's case files about Harley. Her father suffered from mental illness that eventually drove him to suicide. An illness with a strong hereditary link. It's very possible she wants the serum to prevent the same thing happening to her. If she fails, she's got one deadly plan B. <laughs> Don't sound so worried, Batman. I'm here to help. We're almost there.
Harley's back is against the wall. If she has Riddler's blood, she'll be incredibly dangerous. Hey, you don't need to tell me. She tried to freeze me to death. Then we're on the same page. She must be gone already. Do you think that means she already has the vials? I don't know, but it's worth a look. Maybe she got scared off before she could find them. C4, plastic explosive. Only a little, though. Must be remnants from something bigger. I don't remember Bane making bombs, and it doesn't match Freeze's M.O. Who then? Harley? John? Even money on both. Dried. Must be from when Harley shot Bane's men. What is it? They're gone. The vials are gone. C4 and stolen blood. So how do those two things add up? So... Keep looking. Someone's damaged this. Hey, Avesta, does this look familiar? We call it a liminal device, a not quite as powerful phalanx key. Some agency field ops are issued one, and if they left it, they must have been rushed. An agency team has been here. It could have been used to access Freeze's container with the vials. Oh. Oh, God. I thought this thing was supposed to preserve him. Obviously, it failed. Decomposition is actually accelerated. They purposefully disabled the capsule. If that's the case, then they were trying to destroy the body. It's textbook asset denial, but it's some sloppy work. They were moving fast. Too fast. Bruce, why? The rapid decay. I wonder if that's a side effect of the virus, or being in that capsule, or both. If Harley decides to release the virus, that sample may be the most valuable weapon we have. Alfred, I did a bioscan of Riddler's corpse. I'm sending the data to you. The body is breaking down, so do your best with it. Received, Bruce. It's... Oh my. This may take a bit of time. So, Waller takes the blood and has Riddler's body destroyed. That would make her the only player who could create a viable Project Lotus sample. Having all the pieces to the puzzle. Oh my god. 
Bruce. The Pact all had problems. Medical problems they needed solving. And if Waller's the solution, she can make them work for her. She's not above using leverage to get people under her thumb. I mean, look what she did with my identity. Harley. The virus! Where is she, John? Where's Harley? I don't think we've been formally introduced. Doe. John Doe. <laughs> Easy, John. This is Avesta. Special Agent Avesta. I'm John Doe. Only Hearts Club. Sorry to hear that, John. Do you think you could answer Mr. Wayne's question? This is a guy, this is a guy who has it all together. How many girlfriends do you have, Bruce? Color me impressed. <clears throat> she was here. Wait, she was here? Yeah. Where is she now, John? This is important. You got some real nerve, you know that? Remember the cafe. Just be yourself, John. <laughs> Did I stuck my neck out for you? Way out! Bane nearly ripped my head off. And for what? She flew the coop! And I, I have nothing. You steered me wrong. At every turn, every bad piece of advice, everything blew up in my face. I was honestly trying to help. Well then, news flash! You're bad at helping, Bruce. Like bad helping, Hall of Fame bad. We need some real answers, Bruce. There's no point. It's over. The pact, the dream, us. Not yet, it's not. She's still out there with a deadly virus in a city full of innocent people. Call me. Got something I care about. It always surprises me how heavy guns are. It's gonna be okay, John. I promise. I care, John. You know that. I'm nearly out of reasons to believe you anymore, Bruce. Ugh. It's been real. What are you doing, John? Leaving. There's nothing left for me here. But a lot of bad memories. And a weird smell. John, I understand you want to run. I've run before. But problems, they just come with you. No matter how far you go. Nope. Pretty sure I can get away from that smell. Damn it, John. Listen to me. 
I need to find Harley. I don't want to do this anymore. Not for you. Not for her. John, please. This is important. I know it hasn't been easy for us, but I am your friend. Okay, buddy. Look, the agency was here. They took the blood. I was up here in a very dark place. They didn't find me, but Harley did. I told her what happened to Riddler. She gave me this. And where do you think Miss Quinn is now? We'd like to find her sooner rather than later. I don't want to find her. My heart can't take another kicking. I don't ever want to see her again. She ruined me. I, I can't. Help me bring her to justice. It's what she deserves, John. Just can't say no to you, Bruce. You gotta keep an eye on this guy. That Wayne charm gets him every time. You sure know how to spin things. All the right ways to uh, twist my arm. It's going to take me a few hours to find her. I have to check a few places, do some things. Okay, we'll come with you. <laughs> no. You won't. Look, I can see you've tried to be nice, but I, I just need some time to think, or whatever. This is, I need to do this alone. I'll call you when I find something. Wait, hold on. We'd really like your help, John. Are you sure you won't reconsider us coming with you? I did. And it's a hard pass. It's okay. Go. Bruce, let's talk about this. He'll come through. He's done it before. It's funny. When you first walked through that door, I honestly thought you came here to check on me. I'm going to track down those vials in the agency's cold storage. Be careful. Thanks. Alfred, how's the bioscan analysis going? Nearly complete. I should have it ready for you when you arrive. I'm on my way. I'm back. I'm taking over at the computer. Please don't. Al. Al, can you hear me? Alfred? Oh, uh, uh, is it, what's, what's the matter? Uh, Thomas, uh, let's, let's chat. Now's the time. It won't be long. No, Al, it's me. It's Bruce. Yes, what would Master Bruce? Think about what you've done. I don't know. He, he, he and the, the, the Cobblepot boy are playmates. Please, please wake up. Bruce, I... Where, where, where am I? Easy, easy. You're in the cave. Take your time, think back, and tell me exactly what happened. Oh, no, it was... It was nothing. I was... I was working and I felt... I felt dizzy for a moment. Uh, I, mu I must have been more exhausted than I realized. Uh, and, well, basically, that's all there is to it. 
First it's your hand shaking, and now you're... you're passing out. We, we can't keep ignoring this. You need to be looked at before it gets worse. Uh, oh, Chet. Hey, uh, hey, 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 be careful. Oh, oh, thank you, Bruce. I'll just catch my breath. Just give me a moment, please. It's all nonsense. What is? Freeze's magic cure-all. It doesn't work as intended. Take a look. The bioscan of Riddler's body. I used the analysis you sent me to simulate its interaction with the virus. And the bat computer promptly found holes in Freeze's calculations. Lotus. Megavirus. Only one known survivor. Riddler. Freeze thinks his blood is now a key to unlocking Lotus's true potential. It appears that Lotus can be synthesized into a restorative agent for the human body. A remarkable one. Well, Freeze got that part right, but... But as soon as Lotus repairs any physical problems, it causes irreparable damage to the subject's brain chemistry. It drives you insane. It's what Riddler meant when he said, I wasn't always like this. All of these people, all of them trying to kill each other, for something that will make them as deranged as he was in the end. We all should know by now that miracles come with a cost. Harley's already insane, Alfred. I doubt she's worried about taking it up a notch. Yes, you're probably right. Although if she wants the serum to avoid what happened to her father, well, <laughs> it's certainly ironic. Run the simulation again, then forward the readings to Special Agent Imana Vesta. Uh, I already ran it several times myself. Uh, I... I wanted to, to be thorough. Silly notion, I know. My problems are purely psychological. My real cure is a very long vacation. Somewhere far away from Gotham. A place where the sun actually comes to visit. Maybe if you'd listen to me and start seeing your therapist. Uh, yes, yes, I know. It's just, the more I talk about my kidnapping last year and my rescue by Batman, the harder it is keeping certain details a secret. You should understand that. Avesta. I read your report. The serum makes the whole thing beyond dangerous. Did you find out where Waller's keeping Riddler's blood? Yeah. She's got the area on lockdown, but I think I can get myself in. And then, I'm taking these things off the table. Permanently. Just... hold on. Let me find a way to help. You've got to be around in case John finds Harley. And this needs to be done quickly. I won't let Waller turn the Agency back into something like Sanctus, Bruce. The vials have to go. Good luck. Let's get you somewhere more comfortable. Oh, Bruce. Uh... Tiffany's up there. She's probably wondering where I hurried off to. I'm sorry, Albert. We can't risk you falling again. Very well. Oh, we, we mustn't keep Tiffany worrying any longer. She's done quite enough of that the past few days. Ready? I'm afraid that's all we do. Worry the ones closest to us. Uh, okay, yes, thank you. The doctor is on her way. How are you feeling? Well, better. A little more rest and some tea and I'll be as good as new. Make that a lot more rest, Alfred. You're hurt. The only thing hurt is my pride. Which, sadly, even the doctor won't be able to fix. You can put up a strong front, but I'm not leaving your side until the doctor arrives. Got it?
Understood. Be straight with me. When you told me Alfred wasn't doing well, is this what you were talking about? I had hoped that would remain discreet. This is not something you hide, Al. How worried should I be? You don't need to sugarcoat it. It's definitely concerning. Yeah, I've told you already that it's fine. Yeah, I'm sorry, it's just... There's a lot more to worry about right now than me. So, Bruce, um, after our little talk at your office, I had an idea. There's something I want to show you. So, I've been working on this in my spare time. I remember you said you could use the help, you know, when you're Batman. I started thinking about a tactical suit, in case I'm ever needed in the field. Para Aramid synthetic lining. Photo adaptive suit coloring. Full spectrum, full surround heads up display. I should be able to get the mesh fabricated in no time. I'm getting ahead of myself. The last thing you want is me out there on the rooftops with you. This wasn't all just about me. You've been going up against some heavy opposition, Bruce. More than usual. Alfred told me how Bane nearly killed you. So I designed you this. That's a gun. Let me read you the specs. Batman doesn't use guns, Tiffany. You mean... At all. I guess I've never seen you use one. I don't use a gun, because Batman doesn't kill. Okay, I get it. Still, criminals are always trying to kill Batman. Are you telling me you've never once considered a gun? Just to even the odds? Never. That would violate my code. So, Batman has a code. Without it, I would become the very thing I hate. Listen, I should have thought it through more. I just got so caught up in the design, I didn't... I have a lot left to learn. No, don't be so hard on yourself. to go. We'll be waiting right here. <laughs>